Vladimir Guerrero starting in right field for the first time as a Ranger, and he only had two games in right field all of last year. Take a look at Matt Trainer. The Rangers earlier in the day sent down Taylor Teagarden and Jared Saltalamakis, or Trainer. He'll have some extra playing time, taking advantage early with the home run, and then in the fourth, some more offense out of him. Launching again into left field. Pierre is back to the track at the wall. He can't get it. Trainer plates two more. Top five. Alex Rios on a third base, and Carlos Quentin off of C.J. Wilson. That allows the run to score as well to single. Some unfortunate luck for Wilson. Then top six, Alexei Ramirez, the single. Gordon Beckham comes in, and Vlad, he still has that arm. Paul Kadurko knows about it and holds up, and that's big because Wilson strikes out Donnie Lucy to get out of trouble. Bottom six, how about Justin Smoke? In the center field, Rios is there. He's got it. Tagging from third is Vlad Guerrero. He scores, it's 4-2. to two. There you go, first career RBI for Smoke. Next up, Trainer. Well, this time he hits it to the double play. Guy can't do it all. Uh, but the Rangers still in the driver's seat ahead 4-2. Frank Francisco on to close in the ninth and able to get Mark Kotze to fly out. Now, don't read too much into it. The reason Francisco has to close because Nathalie Feli is unavailable. He had pitched two days in a row, so it appears Francisco is still in that setup role. It is his first save of the season, and good to see that if you're a Rangers fan. C.J. Wilson, two runs allowed, six innings. He's now 2-1 and, and off to an outstanding start this season. Four straight quality starts.